This year has been hard for everyone, but it has been especially hard on volunteers and medical staff caring for people during the lockdown to combat mental fatigue. Russia has launched a new program of psychological rehabilitation and it involves horses. Our next report gets you more. These young women have helped countless Russian residents in the last year. They delivered food, helped the elderly and the homeless, all when the pandemic was at its peak in Russia. Now they come to this center to release their emotional stress and lose themselves in a world with horses. When you're riding with a horse in the forest by yourself, you feel a sense of peace and calm. Just being here for an hour and a half, you leave with positivity and inner satisfaction. That's why over the course of the past month, I've come up with ways to overcome my apathy. Thankfully, it's practically gone. This center provides what they call equine-assisted therapy. Here, people learn how to interact with horses, to ride, dress and groom them as a way of reaching a positive psychological state. Hippotherapy is about communication with the horse, creating a bond with it and finding ways to socially interact. Because horses also live together in herds, and for a horse to listen to you, you need to display good leadership skills so that the horse agrees to do what the rider wants. While the U.S. National Institute of Health says there is not enough evidence of its effectiveness, Another report claims that horse therapy improved balance, trust and quality of life. The center says around 90 volunteers have participated in the course, which is offered free of charge. Bureau report, we on World is One. Co-presented by Skoda. Simply clever.